we are going to check out Azalea's room in three, in two, in one. Oh my goodness. Wait. <laughs> Hello besties, welcome back to a new video today. My name is Sapphire, I do a ton of cozy game content including Animal Crossing and Stardew Valley on this channel and I am so happy to have you here today. So it's been a hot minute since I've done any kind of Happy Home Paradise content on this channel so I think it's about time that we revisit good old Lottie and Wordle and Nico of course and do a really fun challenge focused around designing a vacation home. But you guys know I'm all about the twists. I love a good plot twist. And I think today we are going to design a home all in grayscale mode. So for those who don't know, the Switch actually comes with a really cool function built in where you can change the color settings of your screen. I have to give credit where credit is due and I did some Googling and I do believe Console Kato started this trend. I do believe it was Console Kato, so shout out to them for, I guess, creating a really awesome trend. Now, I know what you're all thinking right now. Sapphire, you can just easily check the color of each furniture item based on customizing. And yes, that is absolutely true. You can do that. I will take this challenge one step further and I will change the language of my Switch so I cannot actually tell what the item is, what color variation it will be. It will totally be just up to the gods of Animal Crossing with this build. Okay, but you guys, Azalea wants an all green furniture vacation home. How funny would it be if we just picked her and then <laughs> did not follow that at all? All right, besties, I am back. I have changed up my screen. This already is so weird. Look at the Animal Crossing logo. Like they actually changed the logo in game. That's actually so cool. All right, let's go ahead and boot Animal Crossing back up and we'll head over to the Happy Home Paradise Island and get this challenge going. This is literally so weird. <laughs> I'm so nervous. This is this could either be really cute or end up being like the ugliest thing in the entire world. I'm assuming this is the correct button. Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> All right, I think we'll go ahead and we'll start with the outside. I don't even know what Nico's giving me right now. <laughs> I don't know what this is. I don't even know what's happening right now. Um, Thank you, bestie, thank you for the gift. We'll keep it pretty simple, um, just a cute little outdoor area, some gardening, of course. I love I love incorporating gardening into my builds, typically. Um, it's just a really cute way to like, take up space, and it just like looks good. So we'll do that. And as for the path, we might as well just, I have a custom path here. We'll just use this, probably. Um, it has a little bit of green in it, I know. So we'll just end up using that, I think. All right, path is laid down. I think we'll go ahead and we'll add some bushes as well, kind of leading up to the, the house. I don't know if there are any green colored bushes. Oh gosh. <laughs> um, oh no. Okay, I don't think any bushes come in color green actually. So we'll just maybe use uh, these ones. I Are these white? I, I think these are white colored bushes, I hope. And we'll also put a tree down as well. This is a pear tree, I know for sure. <laughs> um, so we can do that. Ooh, oh no. Uh, oh no, the iron table is gonna be so hard to find. I don't even know. <laughs> I don't even know how to find that one. All right, I didn't think the hardest part about this challenge would be just to figure out where items are located without having like any kind of searching system. <laughs> oh no, I am just a poor soul trying to find iron table and just it is not happening. Where the heck? Oh no. All right, there we go. There we go. So yeah, we'll put some little chairs like underneath here. This can be her little like sitting area. And then we can do maybe like a lamppost. I don't know what color to even pick. Okay, well that's white obviously. <laughs> um, I think the default 
is green. I believe the default is just green. So we're gonna go ahead and we'll just plop a few little street lights down as well, maybe. We will put some pretzels on top of the little table. Little snack, a little a little table snack could be kind of fun. All right, and then I wanna also do my garden section. So we'll go ahead, we'll put some little rows of dirt down. We can do this one. I, like, I think this is just like a really cute fence option for farms. It kind of looks like that rustic sort of farm look to it. And then for the flowers, do we even want to attempt to find the green mums? <laughs> um, oh gosh, is this green mums or is this white mums? I have no idea. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and we'll just try it. We'll try a different color mums. So we'll pick this one. We'll pick, that has to be like purple, I think. We'll pick these, but I think those might be white mums. I have no idea. Oh no, is that it for the mums? Wait a minute. Oh no, there's more over here. Okay. Let's hope one of these is green, okay? Let's just hope. Let's just manifest it. Ooh, we could add one of these little gazebos. I don't even know what color would be the best. I know this is like the natural kind of gazebo, um, which could be nice. I'll just like plop this one down maybe and we'll see how that ends up looking with the rest of the stuff. Liking it so far though. Um, what else can I add? One more tree maybe? Can a tree fit right here? Cute, ooh, okay. Oh, we could try for some of these little wooden partitions. Oh, I have no idea what color would look the best. Um, let's try this one. It has a really cute little like flower design. That could look really sweet maybe. And that can kind of go like right in the back here. So yeah, I think we'll go ahead and we'll do the interior. Oh wait, the house. Oh, I forgot. Ooh, okay. Oh boy. If there are like any green roofs, what the green color roof is. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, oh no. Um, this is just eeny, meeny, miny, mo at this point. I, I'm feeling this one. I'm feeling bottom right. Let's try that one. Oh, I'm feeling this. I think this is a green. Or is it this one? Oh no, which one is green? I don't even know. All right, I'm feeling this. Oh. <laughs> and then this for the door. Let's just do it. Let's just do it, you guys. I think this is our greenhouse. So Homegirl did give us some pieces of furniture. How sweet of her. We already have these two outside, but we will use this little pear dresser as kind of our guide. But yeah, we'll just start, I think, with the flooring and wallpaper choices, which I'm already scared for. <laughs> I don't know if there are any choices that are green. We might just want to try like some sort of neutral. Like this, I know this one's like a brown. This is all brown basically. What the heck is this? Is this like lockers in a train station? That's kind of weird. Anyway, <laughs> moving along. Okay, I found these two. I don't know what color these two are like originally, but they are kind of speaking to me. I think we'll try for this one and then we'll just kind of maybe do like a cute wooden flooring to match perhaps oh god <laughs> so now we could go for stuff that's like in her order but that's too easy i feel like i kind of want to deviate from stuff in her order and just like look in the furniture catalog and just pick stuff from that you know which we will do i think we'll just go ahead and try it we'll see how this works and this comes in like so many colors and I have no idea which one's green. I actually think it's this one. So we're gonna go ahead and try this one maybe. Okay, this looks kind of ugly, but that's okay. <laughs> Let's try and find a bed for our girl to sleep on. I have no idea where I can even find beds in this game. It's all out of order. I'm all tipsy to be confused. It's also this one. I think this is like the, the Dreamy Bed series, which is really cute. Hmm. If I'm being pulled to this pattern with the flowers on it. That might be our best bet for a green bed. <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and we'll try that out. If you kind of want to give Zalia some sort of like open concept floor plan, you know what I mean? Yeah, we could try just to have like separated rooms. I am really bad at open concept floor plans though in like any kind of interior design games. I don't know how the Sims besties do it really because like I just cannot for the life of me figure out like a floor plan. We're gonna 
<laughs> we're gonna try and make this work and then we'll have like a wall right here for the bathroom, I guess. Yeah, that kind of works actually. All right, this is her little bathroom space. This is the entrance. This is her little bedroom area, kitchen, and then we'll have just the little couch area. Living room set over here. Beautiful, okay. So this is doing something. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and we'll try to pull some bathroom stuff, although I have no idea where I'd find that. <laughs> I did not think about how hard it'd be to actually find, like, furniture without knowing the names and stuff in, like, a different language, obviously. So I'm just gonna, like, pull stuff whenever I see that could possibly work. And then I also have this, like, elegant mirror, which could also go in her, like, bedroom area. I don't know what all colors this comes in. We'll just... I don't know, we'll just pick this. <laughs> it's like sort of randomized, sort of not randomized, you know what I mean? It's, I don't know. We'll see how this all turns out. <laughs> oh, you guys, should we do palm trees? That might be honestly super fun. I kind of like that idea actually. Yeah, we're gonna, I think, do palm trees <laughs> in the living room. That sounds so fun, honestly, okay. These are like all different vibes. <laughs> Like, we have bamboo bathroom, we have like palm tree tropical living room. <laughs> and I also, I have no idea for the actual like kitchen area. I do not know for a kitchen. I think this might work. I believe that's like the rustic color. And then we also have the stove here. I have no idea for the stove. I think we'll just keep it this color. I think that's just like the chrome. Probably use an iron chair and table again for the counter space. Um, just to keep it kind of simple and I don't want to keep searching for like items that I don't know exist. So, I am liking this so far. This space in the middle seems pretty empty, so I'm not really sure what to add. We could just do like a giant rug maybe. Also, rugs scare me. I don't know what kind of rugs are green in this game. Um, okay, this has to be a green rug, right? This has to be green. We'll just try that. I have no idea. I have no idea. This has to be green though. We can do... Can this fit like right here? Is that like too messy? You could do like... That? Ooh, yeah! Okay, that's kind of cute. Watermelon, lemon... Oh, we could do a pear rug! That'd be so cute. Okay. I uh, yeah, okay. Right? That's something. This whole like theme so far is just like grandma core slash tropical core slash pear core. <laughs> I have no idea. And then you have the bamboo corner as well. I have, I don't know. This is kind of a hot mess, but <laughs> I'm hoping it looks cute in the end. That's like, that, that's just, that's all I want. I just want this to be cute. For good measure, let's just like add a bunch of plants in like her house as well. Just like put them everywhere. Just like dump them plants. <laughs> Need to find bathroom stuff ASAP. <laughs> I'm really hoping to find any sort of toilet, any sort of sink will do. <laughs> Many unbearable hours later. All right, that took way too long. <laughs> I finally found the toilets. So good news. We can give our girl Azalea a place to uh, do her business. <laughs> um, we'll just keep this like the white color probably. I think this is probably the white color just to keep it simple. And then I think for the bedroom, it's kind of hard to like see the bedroom sort of. Well, we'll go this way maybe, we'll go this way. Um, we could give her like a bookshelf maybe in the corner if I can find the bookshelf item. <laughs> um, Okay, I had a really cute idea. What if we like put a little bike in this corner? I don't know. Can this even work? Let's try to let's try to fit this. I think this could work though. Yeah, I think that'd be kind of cute. Like, I don't know. Homegirl just puts her bike in the bedroom <laughs> for some reason. I think it could work though. Let's maybe move on to wall items. Which might be easy, I hope, because a lot of wall items in this game are like plant-based stuff, so potentially could be cute. 
and I'm just gonna do random, random customizations. I have no idea what any of this is, so. This is the moss ball wreath, so we might as well put it up there <laughs> just to get some more green. Some stuff we know is definitely green in this in this look. Oh my gosh, should we just put up villager photos that are like green villagers? <laughs> that could be so cute. Azalea. I mean, Azalea is kind of a green color. Oh gosh. All right, put in the comments below: Is Azalea a blue villager or is she a green villager? <laughs> This is gonna be the next, like, is Whitney blue or white trend. <laughs> is Azalea green or is she blue? And then we'll also do maybe, oh goodness. Um, what's this? What item is this? Beads? That could be really cool. I don't know what color the beads are. We'll just try this color maybe and see if that ends up being something. <laughs> And I think we're gonna we're gonna finish up, you guys. Oh my goodness, I I'm so nervous. <laughs> uh, I'm so nervous. Okay. All right, besties. Welcome back to the world of color. We are going to check out Azalea's room in three, in two, in one. <laughs> my goodness wait oh my god this is so cool the wallpaper okay that okay wait oh my goodness this is so pretty are you kidding me Ooh. okay so the lights were not the right color the lights were not the right color and neither was that little mirror in the corner there wait this is so pretty i'm actually super into this and actually, the wallpaper looks pretty similar to like a yellowish green. It's like, you know, it's not quite green, but like it's in that family of colors that just like looks so pretty. <gasps> Ooh, and we also, we totally nailed the color of this little patchwork couch. This is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's, let's go outside. All right, besties, did we nail the exterior? Did we nail the exterior? Please. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. <gasps> oh my goodness. Wait, this is so pretty. And the green mums, you guys. <gasps> the green mums, it looks so pretty. And okay, also, house isn't too bad. The door, that purple door, um, <laughs> is an interesting choice. Wait, this is actually so cute. This is so freaking cute. Are you kidding me? I, I was so scared. I thought the wallpaper would honestly either make or break this challenge, but it looks so cute. Oh my gosh. Thank you all so much for watching today. If you did enjoy this video, please do leave me a comment down below telling me if you think I passed or failed on this challenge. Again, my name is Sapphire. I do a ton of Animal Crossing and other cozy game content on this channel, and I try to post at least once a week. For more content just like this, you can follow me on Twitch for the live experience. Again, thank you all so much for watching today. Have a great, big, beautiful day, and I will see you next time. Bye!